Here we go on another tale. I had another video. I don't know if I've uploaded it yet. I'll make sure you'll see it. It's the one that was a lightning storm. Where I went down to Buffalo. Try out my dash. This is Eddie B. Censored and sponsored by Eddie B. Because it's my video. I just want you to know one thing. There may be a few racial slurs, but I just want you to remember also, I'm only kidding you. These young men down there in Buffalo, they're a bunch of rascals, let me tell you. They're down South Buffalo, and after that thunderstorm lightened up, you would not believe it. The streets were as busy as they is long. The day is long since Eddie B was on the job. I seen a few things down there in Buffalo. Going down this one street, I seen, I think, what I thought I saw was an urban robbery in progress. Well, the SWAT was there, and oh lord, the cops were bustling everywhere. They handled the whole situation lickety split. They surrendered. They decided the odds weren't good, and the police officers, they had themselves a good day. I didn't record it because uh, you misconstrued a video, you know. Let me tell you, I do some Eddie B videos, and I wish I could report. But I don't know what was really going on there. I just know what's... You don't have a swap there for no reason. Jeez. Well, then, uh, about, you know, I'm about ready to be done. After that, I told Uncle that was pretty scary. I called up my Uncle Keith there. Yeah, I'm shouting out to you, Uncle Keith there. So I'm looking there, and I'm going through, and I'm like, you know I'm going to check out the South Buffalo. Well, i tell you what about that South Buffalo. There's some good folk there. I've met some really fine ones, and there's a few that were a little bit sketchy, but they still ended up being my friends. Because I'm Eddie B. Dasher Extraordinaire. Going to Dash America. Just one more adventure for another tale for another time. But anyway, I was telling you about this. You, you can pull up in front of the 7 Eleven. It's 3 a.m. I'd been doing another three hours. I was about to be the last one because I put N Dash after this one. So I took it and I went to the 7 Eleven down in the ghetto. I went up to this 7 Eleven that was no bigger than one of those small trailers. It looks like one of those little travel trailers, you know, the ones that you, your mom, uh, or not your mom, your grams, and your grams, and them driving. I don't know, motorhome. The thing was so small, there were sick people inside the store, and it was crowded. If I friggin' wanted a Twisted Tea, I could reach over, the Twisted Tea was to my left, and if I wanted a beer, it was on the other side. I mean, it was like walking through one of those bathrooms. It's like, you know, you turn around bathroom, nah, you can't get more than two people in there. It's like squeezing a sardine out of a can. But anyways, so I get in there, and... The young men in there said, man, you're in the wrong town. So why is that? I said, because they're about to eat you alive, I think. I said, well, I guess we'll see about that. I said, I'm just here for an order. I'm just here. I'm Eddie B. Dasher Extraordinaire. Well, they said, well, and then got my stuff together and I said, good luck. So I go back out and this thing's in outside the door. He said he liked my hat. He complimented it. I thanked him for opening the door. I think he wanted my hat. I'm not sure. I guess I'll never find out. Whatever he was packing, I don't know if it was the beef. Because he seemed to be a pretty good gent after I threw him a few jokes or two. And I told him, I see. You know what I see? Me looking at you and you looking at me. Human beings, that's what we. We. We are human beings, see? <laughs> I was just being crazy. And you know what? He laughed. I think that's why I got to escape that one. But that's all. I have to really report.
I got out of South Buffalo by the skin of my teeth. And I seen a lot while I was down there. It was fun. But I think that, you know, how the old cartoons, you got them there, little devil, you know. Well, the devil won yesterday, but today I took the day off and spent it with my family. But until the next time, I'm going to sit here on my front porch, finish my cigarette, go lay down, ain't got no power in the house, somehow the freaking power got shut off, we got generator running out back. Alright, I keep trying to end this video, but till y'all see me again, it's Eddie B. Dasher extraordinaire. Y'all have a good one, yeah?